with a stat of nearly 47% of adults in the United States and a global number of 26% being affected. High blood pressure is one of those pretty common medical conditions in the world. Aside from being dangerous on its own, it also comes with certain complications resulting in even more serious health problems like say a stroke, heart attack, or kidney disease. The thing about high blood pressure is that some of the things we take contribute to elevated levels and in today's video, we'll be taking you through 12 foods that elevate your blood pressure, including some that you might not like if you're a, um, foodie? Stay tuned guys. If you've not already taken the action, please subscribe to the channel for more amazing content like this. Now sit back to the video. Number 1. Salty Foods one of the major causes of increased high blood pressure is table salt, or pretty much anything that contains too much salt. The thing is, salt contains sodium, which is in fact the main instigator of high blood pressure in many cases. Things like processed or fast foods usually contain sodium levels up to more than the recommended 2300 milligrams that a person should consume per day. According to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, or CDC, in this category we have things like rolls and bread, canned soup, tacos and burritos, and sandwiches falling under the category. Number 2. Sugary Foods If you're a huge fan of sugar, then it might interest you to know that it happens to be one of the leading causes of high blood pressure. Sugar found in processed desserts, prepackaged meals, or peanut butter, for example, have been suggested to be some of the food products that could actually increase your blood pressure. As if that's not enough to know, a study published in 2014 on Open Heart suggested that sugary foods might even be more dangerous than salt when it comes to blood pressure, and if you're wondering why, the addition of high fructose corn syrup to some foods serves as the major factor behind it. Number 3. Red Meat According to Medical News Today, the redder the meat in color, the more likely it is to increase blood pressure levels. There are several kinds of red meats and they include beef, lamb, pork, veal, venison, and goat meat. And oh yeah, they all fall under the kinds of red meats that can increase your blood pressure. If you're a fan of any of these, or you simply like them, it might interest you to know that the process involved in metabolizing these red meats in the body may release certain compounds that can increase blood pressure. Number 4. Pizza Pizza falls under the category of things that are highly consumed in many places around the world. However, it's been attributed to having constituents that can result in high blood pressure. According to Health Central, a slice of cheese and pepperoni pizza can contain more than half of the daily recommended dietary sodium. So I need not mention what happens when you down more than two slices. Number 5. Chicken While you might find this weird, processed chicken may also cause elevated blood pressure levels. During the processing of chicken, they are usually injected with some salt water solutions and that makes them more like a hidden source of sodium. Quite interestingly, it also is one of the top 10 sources of sodium according to the CDC. Number 6. Bacon and Deli Meat Like chicken, bacon and deli meat is also loaded with salt, hence increasing recommended sodium levels for intake. Incredibly, the American Heart Association states that just 6 thin slices of deli meat have as much as half of the recommended daily sodium intake of 1500 mg. Number 7. Bread if you're on the lookout for one of the food items that contribute the most sodium in the American diet, then you'd find yeast bread. According to Health Central, a simple slice of Whole Foods organic 100% whole wheat sandwich bread is estimated to be the equivalent of 22 potato chips. You can imagine. Number 8. Alcohol The thing with alcohol is that if it's taken in moderate amounts, I mean one or two drinks per day, it can be considered not problematic. But you see, when you take more than that, there is a huge risk not only to increase the blood pressure, but it also could serve as a potential cause for heart disease. Alcohol contains quite a lot of empty calories and this can even cause unintentional weight gain. Number 9. Condiments Just like quite a couple of things already on the list, condiments contain high amounts of sugar or sodium and as such, it becomes a risk factor for high blood pressure. Condiments like ketchup, chili sauce, soy sauce, or salad dressings fall into this category. Number 10. Chips, Popcorn and Crackers 
While all three might serve as handy snacks to, uh, make up your perfect movie night or Netflix and chill, they count as salty snacks which make them high in sodium and well, you know what that means. Even in cases where these snacks come with reduced sodium levels, they still do not mean that they are entirely low and could actually still contain more sodium than you should take. 11. Saturated Fats In this category, things like chocolates, cakes, sausages, oils, cooking fats, and full-fat dairy products like cheese or cream, or even yogurt, may put you at risk of high blood pressure. Saturated fats can cause problems relating to your cholesterol levels and they also increase your calorie intake. While taking them doesn't exactly mean you're at risk, reducing your intake of them might just keep you safe. Number 12. Frozen Dinners Ideally, everyone just wants a simple way to go about things, and frozen dinners does bring that option when it comes to preparing meals. However, they have been known to contain really high levels of sodium, which in turn presents a risk of elevated blood pressure. Some of these frozen dinners are even referred to as salt bombs, and if you're buying one with low calories or from a healthy brand, sodium remains very present, as well as added flavors. As the saying goes, health is well. And if you're considering taking that quote more seriously, especially when it comes to your blood pressure, you should consider staying off or reducing your intake of any of these foods. Don't forget to subscribe. Till next time, bye.